Walton County is growing fast with more people moving to the area. Having a good school is a driving factor in where to plant new roots. As News 13's Kimber Collins tells us, the school district is working on a massive project in Freeport. Hard work is underway on the new Freeport Middle School. Located in the Hammock Bay community off Highway 20, the facility is said to increase student capacity from 700 seats to 1,000 something the Walton County School District is in need of. We have seen over a 40% increase in our schools here in Freeport area in the last five years. That's a significant amount of student enrollment. With an $81 million price tag, the new state-of-the-art facility will have a media center and athletic complex, making a drastic change from the current middle school off Main Street. Freeport Middle School has a few buildings that are as old as the 1940s or 50s. So we are super excited to bring a brand new, innovative, um, beautiful new school campus to our students in the Freeport community. Well, you can hear and see the progress here on the 32 acre lot as Culpeper Construction continues clearing the area for the new middle school. Where I'm currently standing will be the new softball field. And as you heard the district say, they are excited to be open in fall of 2024. Our middle school now, we do have portables. So the students and the faculty and staff are already there. We're just trying to get this new facility to them as fast as we can. The district said the old Freeport Middle School will be repurposed into a new education building, but no official plans have been determined. In Walton County, Kimber Collins, News Channel 13, Panhandle Strong. Walton County is also finishing a large renovation at Freeport Elementary School, adding 50,000 square feet for new classrooms, a new cafetorium, a media center, and additional skill labs.